Hi Capricorn, welcome to the channel. Welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody's doing great. Uh, we're going to do your reading here in a moment. A couple things. Everything you need to know about my channel is in the description box. I have opened up personal readings again, so details how to contact me. Also, if you'd like to enter my personal reading giveaway, details are below. So with that, um, we're going to see what the universe wants to ha make happen for you in the next 30 days. So I'm going to pull your cards and then we will go through them. Oh my gosh, this card keeps coming out a lot, a lot here, Capricorn. Let's see what else. We've got angel protection there. All right, let's pull the tarot and then we will go through the cards and see what we have here. Okay. All right, Capricorn. I feel what um, the universe is making happen in the next 30 days is I feel like there's an energy here of this person wanting to restore some sort of balance in your life, okay? Some of you, I feel it's emotional, emotional balance. Um, you do have adjacent possibilities here. And this is showing me that there are some new doors that are going to open up for you. So I sense that Capricorn, there could be some sort of cycle or something that keeps repeating in your life or an energy where you may be feeling like you haven't had many options or you feel like there's only been one option and you've been kind of sticking to that option. But I sense here that that's coming to an end here with the Ten of Wands, okay? It's coming to an end, the end of a difficult time, um, an end to if you've been feeling like people haven't supported you. You got the Eight of Swords here as well, okay? So I feel like what's going to happen here, Capricorn, is there's going to be some new opportunities, some new possibilities here, right? Even though the universe is going to make that happen for you, you know, this Eight of Swords is, is a self-imposed stuck. So you're going to have to, right, pursue those options, those opportunities if you're feeling stuck, right? But the doors are going to open for you. You're going to have some choices and know that all the choices are not going to be good choices. Now, this could be around your career, right? This could be, you know, maybe friends. This could be around love, now, the next card that you have here is the Healer of Ages, okay? So the yellow energy here is the Solar Plexus Chakra. So there's a lot of, um, there's different meanings here, but this can be about your free will and your choice, okay? You have the choice to explore these other options, right? To take that initiative. And also, this can also be about, there could be some emotional, um, emotions that you are holding in your solar plexus chakra, which is right above your rib cage. Okay. So I feel like there could be a situation that you've been dealing with. You got the five of swords. It's showing me here that, um, it's a time to, you know, do what's best for you and get what you want. Okay. I feel like that's what, uh, the universe is trying to make happen for you is to get you to be in a place where you go after what you want. You seek these other alternatives. You have the Knight of Cups here as well. Now I'm going to say for some of you, this could be um, some a friend, somebody that helps you during this time as well. 
Um, some of you, this is around healing too, okay? So you may be healing from a certain situation, a romantic situation. It could be a situation where someone was playing games here with you. But I feel like this is what they're saying here, Capricorn. Now is a time for you to, um, to learn from whatever this, I'm going to call it the rabbit hole, okay? The rabbit hole, whatever this rabbit hole is or whatever this, cycle here that keeps repeating i feel it they're telling you it's a time for your own healing and it's a time for you to make the decision here to do what's best for you and to move forward um, with the knowledge and experience that you learn from it because the next card that you have is all tied up this is a self-imposed stock this is an energy here of feeling stuck and remember i said that you have angel protection here with the angel of balance so as i said i get an energy here an overall energy here is that the universe wants to restore balance into your life you got the temperance here and you also have here the hermit so i feel like capricorn again another card here with the temperance of balance you know, um, balancing, you know, emotions, it can be a time where you're needing to do some inner reflection here, some soul searching, tempering the emotions, because I do feel like there's emotions involved in this situation. You also have here the six of pentacles and you have the seven of pentacles. Okay. So I feel like, um, Capricorn that balance is going to be restored here in your life and what's really nice is I feel like the efforts right your efforts where you're putting your time and your energy which I feel here is with yourself I feel it's going to be really fruitful you're going to see the rewards here let's pull some more cards because I feel like there's a strong energy here of you know balance now for some of you I'm going to say you got the two of pentacles and you also have here the queen of pentacles so some of you i feel like too this is like gaining your footing right being grounded i feel like typically capricorn you're an earth sign so i feel like you're more so grounded um but it does feel like there's a situation in your life that is not in balance Let's see what else um, the universe wants to make happen here, Capricorn, in the next 30 days. Okay, we have the Knight of Swords. We have the Strength card. We have the Ace of Wands. Look at that. And we have the World. Okay. And bottom of the deck here, look at that. We have the Knight of Pentacles. Really nice energy. So I sense here, Capricorn, there is some sort of communication I feel like you're going to get here. Okay. It could be this new opportunity that I'm seeing. I see, you know, the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords here. So this is some sort of communication that's coming towards you. It's leading to something I feel that is going to be more consistent in your life. Now, some of you, you can be around love. It could be somebody here who, who is interested in you, right? Who communicates. As I said, doors are opening. For some of you, I feel like this could be around a work situation, right? Some sort of offer. Some sort, um, this could even be... Um, if you just started a new job, I feel like for some of you, this could be that you work your way up quite quickly. This could indicate um, some type of reward or bonus or pay increase or uh, promotion, I feel here. There's something that's about to change pretty quickly for you is what I'm getting, okay? You have the strength card, okay? And the strength here, like I said, it's a time for you to really think about you, okay? And if you've been dealing with others or people who you feel like have, you know, maybe people who have played games or people who have not really been there for you or you feel like there's constant conflict, 
um, or not being supported, I feel there's an energy here of you finding that inner discipline here. Okay, finding that inner discipline here to also, I feel here, control um, the emotions of the situation. Okay, so it can be also to avoid conflict as well. But as I said, I feel like there could be somebody kind, somebody kind who helps you. Some of you, you know, this could be a new love situation as well. You do have the Ace of Wands. So there is some sort of new opportunity I feel that is going to make you feel more confident, maybe make you feel more desired, um, you know, whether it's in your career, whether this is in love, but there's a new opportunity and I feel like this is going to change your life. It's going to change your world here. And that world card fell right with the six of pentacles and the seven of pentacles. So I feel um, Capricorn, there's some sort of new opportunity that is bringing more consistency in your life and it's going to be worth investing into, okay? Because you have the Knight of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck here and you also have here the Sun card. So really what I feel is happening, Capricorn, right? Repeating energy. There is some sort of new opportunity that is happening in your life that is going to bring you down to earth, so to speak, okay? It's going to make you feel more stable. It's going to make you feel more secure. I feel like it's going to make you feel more excited, more motivated here. Um, it's going to take you out of that energy here of feeling stuck. Um, and I feel like more confidence, you're going to feel more confident about this, but you know, with that nine of swords energy too, more excited. Some of you may get the opportunity to travel. Okay. So if this is like a job opportunity or you're working for a company, you may even get the opportunity to, to travel, um, for your job or for your work. There's a lot of potential and there's a lot of happiness here, I feel. So if you've been feeling unbalanced about a situation, Capricorn, that's changing, okay? But I also feel it's an energy here of you doing what's best for you, okay? You looking out for you. So let's see uh, what the Goddess Guidance deck has to say. Okay, look at that, home. Your household situation is improving either through a move or healthy change in occupants, okay? So some of you could be making a home move. There may be uh, someone moving in or moving out. Okay, let's see what else we have. Oh boy, we have undying love. The love you have shared is eternal regardless of the situation, okay? So some of you, I feel, right, you could be dealing with a love situation. Some of you, I feel like this is that undying love for you, for yourself, okay? Feeling good, feeling like you are at home. And we have transformation. You are experiencing enormous change right now, which brings great blessings yeah there's there's a lot of changes i feel like you are going through capricorn and i'm going to say interesting enough cancer's reading had both undying love and transformation okay let's pull one more for you capricorn what else does capricorn need to know okay focused intention i think cancer got this too keep your unwavering thoughts feelings and actions focused on your target and you will make your mark okay so I feel, um, Capricorn, there are new doors opening for you, but the, the theme I get here is balance. Something that was not consistent in your life or you were not feeling things were consistent or balance is changing now. You're going to feel more confident. You're going to feel more uh, passionate, assertive, and there's some sort of new opportunity that's bringing a big change, a significant change in your life. And, it, and I'm going to tell you, it's worth the investment. That's what they're saying here. That's why they're saying to stay focused. Okay. 
And look at that. You got the golden opportunity too on the bottom of the deck. Okay. So I was just talking about how um, it's really worth investing right in this opportunity because this is an opportunity I feel that's not going to come around. Uh, it's I feel like it's almost like a once in a lifetime opportunity that is happening for you this change right it could just be you're going through an enormous transformation in your life but I sense too for some of you if this is around career this could be the opportunity you've been looking for okay even in love so Capricorn I hope this reading helped you I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening and I'm sending you angel love